Oh. I'll repeat. I don't know if it's really good. You talking about your dad? No, the Great Hinge. Because I don't know if your dad's really good. Because he left. Did he ever get those cigarettes? What were they, Virginia Slims? No, man. That's for ladies. Exactly. They're illegal. You can't buy them unless you're a lady. That's for ladies. I'm going to take this Great Hinge and see what we can do with it. No, it was close. He was a hipster. Oh, welcome back. We're going to do another Throne of Eldraine draft here on Magic the Gathering dot com the internet's greatest draft machine in we space go on food tokens make giant opportunity work buddy mm -hmm. I'm getting real tired of your shit it's very aggressive uh, well I'm getting tired of it Michael we're playing magic the gathering online magic magic card games and gaming and video games I think it's just the scorching dragon fire yeah, exactly. Exactly. I would take Dragonfire over Reef Soul. Soul over Oven? I would take this over this. And I'd probably take them both over this. But maybe I do want this just to make this fat giant daddy. I'm taking this. I'm staying green and I'm taking it. So I'm taking this, and the reason is I want to be able to be like, make a 7-7, play this for two. That's all I want to do. Jokisha in the house. So if we have this, it's six mana. Okay, I guess that's fine. God, I always lean towards this stupid red-green, this white-green deck, and I don't like it. Maybe Witch's Oven's good. Oh, Witch's Oven might be good with the Giant Opportunity. No beats coming through. I'll take this witch's oven. Twitch watch parties. Let streamers watch Prime Video with viewers. Thank you. Oh, Cassius, what's up, my dude? Thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Super happy to share my one year and entertain me whilst I wait for these instruments to analyze some samples. Wow. I don't even know what's happening Sounds right now. Hot. That does sound like a hot night. Hot night in the city. Um, is it this Grum Gully? You've fallen into the red-green trap, man. This guy's good, though, man. I mean, yeah, but you have to play red-green. This guy that sucks. There's nothing else in this pack I would take over it. Red-green's only good if you have, like, the nuts red-green. Oh, wow. Let's get a little Michael the expert. The red-green expert. You That's how red-green always works. Oh, is it? Twitch has started testing a new feature that allows streamers to watch Prime Video with their viewers, as long as they're also subscribers. Oh, interesting. Travis Schreffler, a content creator and author, has tweeted an email he received from Prime Video inviting him to test a new feature called Watch Parties. The invitation says streamers will be able to show a selection of Prime Video movies and TV series on their channel so they can watch while chatting with their audience. Miraculously, the viewers will also have... Fr that's awesome. That's... That's gasoline, dude. I kind of like this Maryleaf Pixie. I took it. Good for you. Thank you, dude. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Franklin, this is your mother speaking. I want you to be nice to young Moochel on his birth. Damn it. Damn it. It is Wednesday, my dudes. It's Tuesday. My dudes. It's Wednesday in like three hours. It's Michael, my dudes. How's the little man? He's doing better. He got a stronger dose of antibiotics today. He apparently does not have a blockage, which is great. But he still does have bacteria and red blood cells and white blood cells. Don't um, cut him up. What? Gunking him up. Gunking, yeah, he's there. They're gunking him money. up. Cabalin. Five for Frank to convince Mike B to draw Scrober so I can make it into a costume. <laughs> I don't even know where I'd start. Well, that's your that's your that's what your does problem. Scrober isn't look it? like. To live in my hometown. I mean, I could draw it, but I don't know where I'd start. You start at the Scrober and you work your rep to the Bober. Those are two different things. Are they? Everybody knows that prove it what do you got man scratching where are you scratching bro my leg your leg my inner thigh okay oh i getting a little close here my dude <laughs> i guess we're just playing at least green piggies wow really 
Yeah. God, why are you such a hater, dude? Six mana to create three one ones. Yeah. My little piggy. Like that's gonna matter. Wow. What's it like being this full of hate? You're like a goddamn Sith Lord. It tells it like it is, okay? Your pigs will never matter. <laughs> Sassy Mike stream is right, dude. God. Shut up and take my money. Two stream day? You're right. I can't see it yet. Hold on. No beats. Stop being a damn Mitch and draw the Scrober Bucks. Wow. Draw the Scrober, you stupid bitch. The Scrober Bucks. Mike's also good at, at drawing, too, so I don't know why he's being such a... such a. Well, I had to come up with the idea of the character first, though. So quit, quit bitching around and do it. I don't know what they look like, man. Well, that was never part of the meme. Wow. So you know what you do in that situation? Hmm. You make it a part of the meme. That's hard, man. Oh, my God. Guys, it's so hard to... Somebody give me an idea. Oh, yeah. I wish this was a mythic, though. Why? Because a foil mythic is like 30 tickets. So oh, it doesn't even okay. matter which one it is. Like, look at this questing beast. Or I guess we'll go with uh, Embercleave, right? Mythic, 14, regular 5. And then you got, like, Royal Scions. Foil, 10, regular 5. It's really weird. The pricing is really weird. But anyway... Midnight Clock's good. Out Muscle might just be better. I don't know. This lets you draw seven. I'm not going to not take this. Those pigs do become nine life. Michael didn't care about that. Nope. He's such a selfish son of a biscuit. You're selfish, Mr. Grinch. Your name is Michael B. That's $10 towards a sober description. Wait, what? Depiction? Are you drunk? You got... How much alcohol is in this by volume? Zero. Fuck, this is just your natural state. Oh, Stone God. zero. You should go get some tequila, man. Get some Glenlivet. No, some... And I forgot what it's called. You did good. What? Did I? No. Oh, you lied to me? I did. <sighs> I should get some of that Breaking Bad Bre stuff. Breaking... Oh, yeah, you should actually. We should actually try that Breaking Bad stuff. We should get that. I'm going to take Sir Eleonora. The discerning. I don't think it's super expensive. Really? Let's find out. What's it called? Do you know what it's called? Mm. Breaking Bad Tequila. Is it tequila? No, it's a, it's a the other kind. I'm a 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 alcohol. Uh, mezcal. Yeah, that's what it is. That's just tequila. Don't be stupid. It's really not. It's basically the same thing. Lucky Clover, huh? What do we got here? Curious Pair. This guy. Queen of Ice. You know what? I'm gonna take this Lucky Clover. I think it's. I think we can make we can make some magic happen. God, guys, the number of times I draft blue green is like it's got to be in the thousands, right? But it's a good combo. How do I buy this? How do I buy the the mezcal? I think they have a website for it. Breaking Bad fans feel duped by Aaron Paul's mezcal. Oh, because he was because he, he like, he was like he probably tweeted like a spoiler, and it was actually about the drink, and people thought it was gonna be about Breaking Bad. It's called Dos Hombres. Okay. Two brothers. Two brothers. Oh, there's an out muscle. Yes. I thought Ombre was friend. Is Ombre friend, my dude? Wait. Wait. <laughs> Alright, I'll wait. You might be right. Like, so this is, it's just a dude. Yeah, ombre's Our just... friends, okay. Because, like, you're not gonna be like, that's one bad ombre, that's one bad brother, that doesn't make any sense. You don't know anything about languages, do you? What a dummy. What a... Apps. Hermanos are brothers, yeah, yeah, you're right. Yeah, you're thinking of Poyos Hermanos. Those are the chicken brothers. <laughs> chicken brothers! And one of them's dead. Oh shit, spoilers. Wow, I can't believe you just spoiled that for someone. Can you imagine if you the first time you watched uh, Breaking Bad it was spoiled for you? That's a very light spoiler. Order now. It's like one episode. Oh, shit, it's got Aaron Paul and Brian Cranston signatures on the bottle? That's gas, yes. dude. They're probably not the real signature, but... They're probably like pre-ordered is my guess. Pre-ordered? Yeah, like I don't think they out yet. Look, it's another Grum Gully, you stupid dummy. Good for him. And all his Gum Gully goo. What? His gum gully goo. His gum gully goo? goo? Yeah. Are we just flashing for the gum gully? Yeah. Got him. There's 
the price at? 62 bones. That's not bad. It's not terrible. For, for a nice size bottle. Oh, you can get custom engraving and a luxury drawstring bottle holder and a handmade leather bottle holder. Wow, these are... Nah, just the bottle's good. You don't want that engraving? I could be like, to my shitbird friend, Moochel. And we're splitting Happy it. birthday. You know what? If we're splitting it, we'll engrave it. <laughs> Split it down the middle. You can get whatever you want on it. You can keep it forever. I keep calling Pioneer Frontier. Tomorrow's Mike's going. birthday. Mezcal shots on me. <laughs> oh, Queen of Ice. You're as cold Playable. as ice. What'd you say? Playable. What? Playable. Why are you yelling? Because you couldn't hear me. I can hear you. Can you hear me? Can you hear me, Michael? What's a good chat? What's a good mezcal mixed drink? Doesn't matter. He's just gonna put Sprite in it. He's just gonna bring mezcal and Sprite with some with some grenadine in it. That's all he's gonna do. It's in like in his fucking head right now. He's like, yeah, that doesn't sound too bad. I mean, with just Sprite would be pretty standard. This talk about Breaking Bad reminds me of the day in organic class where my professor, who loved the show, decided to show us the synthesis to making meth. Ridiculous what you end up learning while becoming a chemist. Yeah, I could see that. So you literally taught you how to make meth? FBI, where you at? Don't do this at home, kids. <laughs> hey, dos hombres. I wonder if you can really make meth that clean. If I can make it like, like on the show. Maybe you can't. Well, I certainly can. I have no idea how to do that. I can do it. I did it once. Mezcal was... With Stegel Radler, with Stiegel. shot of mezcal and a tall boy, Radler is delicious and refreshing. I never heard of Stegel Radler. I don't know what that is. Some kind of beer, maybe. This pack's pretty terrible. I'm just taking the two tickets. Not even caring. Because maybe we splash it. I don't know, man. We got mezcal with honey pineapple syrup. I'm into that. How are you? Seagull Riddler tastes a lot like Squirt. Oh, that's right up my alley. I've never heard of that soda, though. I don't know if that's like a regional soda. It's a citrus beer thing. Hmm. Like a nice cider. It's a beer, Michael. Are you listening? Your liquor store should have it in cans. Okay. Obies, that sounds good, but that sounds like a lot of preparation. I'm, I'm, I'm talking about simple drinks. I don't have like all these ingredients, you know. He's like, he, Mike is basically asking, what two liter can I buy to mix with fucking mezcal in order for it to taste good? Mezcal and soda is called a paloma. What soda is generally used? Is it just like He's club like, soda? What soda can I mix with it? <laughs> I just want the easiest drink I can get. Oh no, it's fine. I'm, I'm sure that's probably an awesome drink, and I'm, I'm probably an idiot for not just doing it, but you know. But you know what? Mezcal with a meatball sub with pepper jack and mayo. Oh, God. <laughs> Dear what God. flavor of Kool-Aid to buy? Hmm. Club soda, yeah. Simple. Flavorless. Spin wheel, keep on turning. Michael B. How come I always see, like, either three rows... Rose Thorn Acolytes or Zero? Hunter's Coffin. Who cares? Did you say no one cares? I said who cares? Who cares that Hunter's Coffin? No, I was talking about the other thing. I was like, wow, that's cold as shit. I would never say that to my boy. I was like, wow, that's a real dick thing to say, man. You're a he's, real He's dick. my adopted son. I would never do that. Yeah, he's a handsome gentleman that has a heart of gold. Ooh, a giant opportunity again. <laughs> I got you, Moochel. Pepper Jack meatball vodka coming right up. Oh, yikes! Absolute yikes! Inspired by the flavors of Subway. 
Is Washington Apple the name of a drink? Yes. Yes. It's a pretty good one. Is it? How do you know? If you like sweet drinks. What if I don't? Then what? Then you probably won't like it. Yeah, that's what I thought. I don't know what to make of this deck. I guess we can cut these grummy boys. Which makes me really sad because they're very good. Two brothers. And there's a giant cat attacking them. It's called Two Brothers. Wow, that was a really good uh, improv of... Uh, oh, secret keeper. That was a good Rick and Morty improv. Two brothers. I was talking about that because of the... Jan Michael Vincent. Because I got the, the, te the mezcal wrong, calling it two brothers. I know what you did. We all know what you did, Michael. We all saw it. In a world full of Jan Michael Vincent's. This January... Jan Michael down your Vincents. I make it illegal to have too many Jan Minor Vicks in one. Are you, oh, did you have a stroke? Name. I did. I forgot the name. Quadrant? Quadrant, yeah. <laughs> oh God. How are you going to miss my awesome pun? Hey, do we have to scoop this Frank out? No, nah, it's a liquid. Frank will pour. Oh, wow. Wow. That's actually pretty good. That's That's actually surprisingly good, Christopher. Christopher, I'm impressed by you. You impress me. This is the deck. I don't think it's good. I hate not playing these two grummy boys. But here we are. So. Well, let's just do it. We'll run it out. Turn two Pixie into turn three Snapper or f these guys is okay. Let's just. So I'm going to try to convince Andrew that we can record this weekend and have a new friends out for next week. I think the only problem with this deck, you don't really have a bomb. I got great hands, you stupid. It's not really a bomb. That Are you creates, serious? That kind of creates bombs. It draws you a card every time you play a creature. It gains you two life a turn. Yeah, but like, what if they have a flyer? Oh, They're not basically a flyer. Dead. What don't I get? Don't I get two life a turn? How big is their flyer? Probably have seven, you seven. or do you plan on watching Living with Yourself on Netflix? I am about three and a half episodes in, and then I started watching it again with Mike, and we're like two episodes in. So, I think it's really good. I'm a big Paul Rudd fan. Yeah, it's been great so far. Interesting concept. Pretty funny. Paul Rudd can do no wrong in my book. If I could, if, if I could only hang out, if I could hang out with any celebrity for like a day, Paul Rudd's definitely at the top of my list. I don't know if he's, I don't know if he's number one, but he's definitely in like top five. Do you know who number one would be? Probably your dad. My dad. Yeah, he wouldn't have a good time. You don't know. Kind of a dick. It's true, he is kind of a dick. I met Paul Rudd on my birthday. Man, Paul Rudd visited you for your for your birthday. That's that's sick, dude. Have you seen the video? That's a compilation of Paul Rudd on Conan's. Le yes, it's amazing. Yeah, he oh always, my god, that yeah. He always great. plays the Mac and Me clip, and it's fucking hilarious, dude. It's absolutely unbelievable. Paul Rudd is the 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 hero we need, man. Look at this innkeeper getting in there. Would you trust this guy? No. What if he was like Michael? He wants to bake your organs. Michael, listen, I'm your father. Come sit down. Let's have a let's have a brother. Let's have a drink like dos om like two brothers. No. Michael, listen, please, please, Michael, it's your father. Mike, can you yell at Hot Gulashi taking a pee? What does that even mean? Just yell at him. I don't like yelling. <laughs> I don't like yelling. Man, Will Farrell's a total jerk. I could never... I can't even. I can't even imagine that. Will Farrell seems like a, a, a sweetheart. That's not the first time I've heard that, actually. Oh, that makes me even more sad. Michael, listen, it's your father. Go on. You are an accident, Michael. <laughs> eh, it's fine. Michael, listen. 
I should have sold you on the black market. I was actually the opposite of an accident. You were an intentional? Yeah. Huh. My parents actually had to try. And then your dad's like, all right, we did it. Peace out. <laughs> well, to be fair. He, Mission accomplished. He didn't peace out until I was like 12 or 13. So. Really? You had 12 years with him? Yeah, give or take. That I did not know. Well, he wasn't like, like I wasn't like in contact. Like I was like mostly phone calls. But like. Where was he? In Ohio. Where were you? I saw him a couple times here and there. Like he came to visit like maybe every couple of years or so. Wait, but why wasn't he living with you? Why were you guys like together? Because my parents were divorced. They were divorced when oh. I was like five. But yeah, like regular phone calls and somewhat regular visitation. My work is done here, and his dad flies away like <laughs> Superman. <laughs> oh, first time Twitcher, a long time. T- you said Tubber, but I think you meant Tuber. But Tubber's pretty funny too. Also, this screen name is a freaking hilarious. Patrick Mahomes, you idiot. That's just funny. Yeah, right around when I turned like 13. You say right around? Right around when I turned 13 or 14. <laughs> what did he say? Was the divorce your fault? Wow. I mean, yeah, but that's that's besides the point, you know? Right around then, uh, he, he was never really paying like appropriate child support. And my mom like won a battle where he had to pay more, and then he like never spoke to me again until I was like 20. Because you were the lawyer in that court battle? Yeah, I actually, yeah. I, you defended yourself? Yeah, I did. That's mm-hmm. fucked up, dude. That's really, I'm real proud of you, though. That's cool. Congratulations for being such a young lawyer. Oh, he came into Ohio? You want me to look for him? No, I know where he is. I just He's just a dick. I know where he lives. Why don't we go visit him? Do you want a road trip and we can we can vlog the whole thing? <laughs> Going to see Michael's dad. Can you imagine? Really like, awkward. It's like the best conclusion possible for like uh, for the stream. Like everyone knows that your the whole your dad leaving is like the big meme, but then we actually go find your dad and we're like, we found Mike's dad. And it should be really awkward to be like, oh hi. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we make two. Oh, look at my beans. So I think we probably just cast this now because I don't think the odds of us uh, being able to cast it later is good. Does he know when your birthday is? <laughs> I think so. No, he don't. I have a decent decent shot of him knowing when that is. This guy doesn't have reach, right? Even though he's literally going into the sky. Super so. Fritz, what part of Ohio are you live in? The green part. What if Mike B's dad shows up at the end of the stream like that part in Waterboy and Bobby Boucher's dad shows up and he's like, it's me, your daddy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, Jesus. Columbus. <sighs> Haven't been. I was always in the Ohio, in the uh, Akron Oh, you were in the Ohio area of Ohio? <laughs> <laughs> That's I almost said that, yeah. It's <laughs> my favorite Ohio. Akron and uh, Cauga Falls. Where are you from in Florida? Uh, Florida. You know, like the top part. You know, like the upper bottom area. Upper bottom. Hmm. Don't talk about my upper bottom, Michael. Don't mess with another man's upper bottom. That's like otherwise known as the fupa. Oh, wow. This is... This is not good. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. I really need to peel away here from this thing. Or not a peel away. God, I always call it peel away. Um, And I'm thinking of peel from reality, which is actually run away together. Where is, uh, she's regular, um, yeah, I don't know. Your answer is good as mine. Uh, yeah, me and my, uh, me and my cousins, I guess uh, used to hang out here. in the more ghetto parts of Akron. Maybe we just take a million. And we wild out a little bit. You guys are maniacs. <laughs> I like you, but you guys are maniacs. Okay, so... Do one of these jammies. One, two, three. Go to nine. Then we go to ten. No, I'm not from Ohio, but I have a lot of family that lives there. So I'd visit pretty often when I was younger. Share my treats. Then we'll play this guy. And then we'll play this guy. 
and then we'll draw a card and we'll hope we can play it. No, oh, we can't, so we're just gonna lose it. That's sad. Sad Michael Bees. I don't even know if I want to actually use this this midnight clock pumpage. Actually, maybe I do, because if I draw a new hand, it's possible that I could actually get peel from reality, bounce this guy, bounce the curious pair. That seems good. And drawing I, seven always seems like a good idea. I literally called it peel from reality again. Oops, there goes gravity. Go on, peel from reality. And I've been here for seven years. I really like it. Uh, I don't know. I thought Ohio was pretty pretty cool place. What do you name human? Huh. At least the cities. So you're just gonna wipe the board except for your giant. One, two, three. Buddy, I got a great henge. Alright, what are we bouncing here? Uh, I don't care about this guy. This guy's not going to draw us any more cards. I guess I just want a curious pair. Thirty years? That's longer than I've been alive. So if we bounce both of these and they still name human, they're gonna kill these two and the all three of their guys and two of our guys, so it's like a four for two. If we don't bounce this, they're probably just gonna name Fairy. So I'm just gonna let it resolve. Like if we lose the curious pair, that's fine. I'll just bounce the Pixie and the Giant. Yep, that's what I figured they'd do. Yeah, this is one of my favorite shirts. Also it's where a meme was born. What was the meme? The tongue meme. The tongue meme? Yeah. Well, I was. God, that was amazing. So what is this? Five, six, seven, eight. So we can't do that yet. We can go witching well. Come on down to the witching well. Uh, oh. Oh, bottom of you. Look at that giant opportunity. Giant opportunity next turn makes this cost two. That's pretty insane. Actually, could we do this turn? One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Now we'd be like several mana shy. Arcana gods, what's going on? Man, I'd love to play some friggin' Frontier. There's gotta be someone with a deck list. Rob's just being a little holdout, and I don't understand. It'll be boy Ollie. He doesn't. He doesn't give a shit about Frontier. He might. Mm. Pioneer, not Frontier. Oh my god! I literally keep calling it. You're saying it so much. I I now think it's Frontier. I don't even know, man. I can post mine. Sure, go for it. Well, hopefully, link it. Don't like copy paste it because that would be brutal. Nice. What is this? Sultai Gitrog. Pioneer, peel away. Yeah, I'm just naming whatever. Whatever comes to mind is what I'm what I'm at. Frontier, Pioneer, PLO. Something like that. PLO. Ooh, witch's oven. Come on down to the witch's oven. Actually, how big is this if we play it? Two, three, four, five. Like Being real like huge. Literally huge. Huge. Should have done it the other way. Okay, man. Yeah, we should have done the other way because then this would get a counter on it. I was just excited about how big it was. I got wrecked. Oh, one approach to the second sun? What a maniac. Going down to the witch and well. I think our opponent's got to be dead, right? 
It's looking good for us. Oh, if we also did it the other way, we would have got to draw a card too. So, yeah, that's that's good. We done messed up, AA Ron. Um, castle Anna one. Uh, we'll go you onto you. One, two, three, four. Done. This gains me two life every single turn, dude. Seven Anatole, what, you're just dead? Okay. Okay. Okay, Ming. We were beating them uh, just to every front, so. How many fronts are there? Seven. Don't talk about my front, Michael. Dude, they're everywhere. Check out Pioneer DLs. There's so many ideas, that's what's awesome. Yeah, but I don't know where to look, Robert. I don't think he can hear you. Listen, Robert. I don't know where to look, okay? Uh, Sophania. What? I said House of Enya. House, House of Enya? House mm -hmm. of Enya? Yeah. Google it like a pleb. Wow. You ever... I lived in the House of Enya once. Sail away, sail away, sail away. <laughs> you only thought of that because of the show. But I still knew it was... Is that on Enya? I think that... Yeah, that is. So why does it matter what made me think of it? I'm just saying. If it wasn't for that show, you wouldn't have thought of that. Who cares? I care. Why? Because I do. Okay. Oh, look at that Garenberg Squire. You want some treats? I'll give you some treats. Did you just laugh? Yeah. What's so funny? It was just weird. What's weird? My treats? Yeah. <laughs> Whatever, dude. Enya like. is kind of awesome. Yanni is better than Enya. Who's Yanni? Who's Enya? Who's Yanya? Going Kenya. To the, the country of Kenya is better than Enya. Oh, only in Kenya. Are they gonna block? What? Pew pew. Get him. Good sound effects, man. Thank you, my dude. It is Wednesday, <laughs> it's my... It's not! <laughs> it's not Wednesday. But it kind of is, right? No. You got two hours and six minutes. Tires. You got tires. Y'all got y'all got tires. You know that? I don't think they're going to win with this double tempting witch, I'm going to be honest with you. Unless they come down with a giant next turn. And then I'm like, oh, shoot, a giant. I heard Laurel. I heard Yanny. <laughs> Laurel. Yanny. Remember that meme? Yes. <laughs> Whatever, man. Laurel. Yanny. <laughs> it's one of the stupidest memes ever. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, Gattenbrig. Oh, he gets a draw card. Be land, be land, be land, be land. Nice. I don't think I can play it this turn, but it does only play this Paladin next turn, which makes this cost four mana right now it costs six mana so we're not quite there yet it's not wednesday because if it is i miss the teenage bottle rocket show that's happening in literally one hour are you going to that how come you're still home watching me i don't even know who that is who's teenage bottle rocket am i old i bet there's some kind of my money's on punk or ska because it's chris yeah wow they just sacked two two weedies to to draw a card out, out muscle dang punk okay you're a punk so what if I am good point I didn't consider that going down to the witching well do 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 I don't I just want to run I don't want to run this guy into this guy this guy looks like a young Barack Obama doesn't he <laughs> Every time I see a little him, bit, I yeah. think about it, I'm like, that's Barack bit. Obama. Oh, you son of a bitch. Where'd you go, Barack Obama? Look at that. That's just young yeah. Barack Obama, man. Pretty much. Oh, 
Um, hmm. Three, so this costs six, and we can play it next turn, and then we can play the other guy off of it. I'm actually just gonna take it here, I think. Alternatively, No, we're gonna block, and then we're gonna insatiable appetite sack the food with this guy. Yep, draw draw another draw another karate boy. Brand new life around the bend. You ready for this? It's gonna be it's gonna be unbelievable. Oh, so we're gonna draw a card from this, from the Great Henge, and then we're gonna also draw a card from the in, the innkeeper. This is going to be the most bonkers blowout nonsense you've ever seen. Sure. Are you ready for the most bonkers blowout nonsense? So this costs three. Draw a card. This guy comes in with a counter. Draw a card. Ooey, Rick. That was pretty good. Heck yeah, it was. And we gained two life. Who would have thought? It's crumbelievable. Oh. His artifact isn't as good as ours. It's not. It's true. Did you see me break it down? No. I kind of went crazy. Why don't you just sail away? Okay. Sail away, sail away, sail Look at that away. dog. <laughs> Look at that dog. That dog's a maniac. Odd question. Feel free not to answer what happens to the sub count. Why is it part of the overlay? Um, I just never... It just didn't benefit anybody to have it on there. It was just real estate that... Um, Oh, you took away your sub count? Yeah, it just doesn't... It, I don't know. I didn't want to focus on it as much as, as I was. Seems a little soul-crushing, to be honest. It can be definitely soul-crushing, yes. Show me that smile. Oh, I'm in my upkeep? Good lord, I'm like playing cards without even drawing my card. For, mm, that's pretty good, I guess. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So we can go... And every creature draws a card. Yeah. What a time to be alive. It's really something. Don't waste another. It's like that Michael combo card, but for everything, Michael's forever. Michael. But everything, forever. Michael B is here. <laughs> the Michael B's are here all day. Whoa, whoa. Gonna bounce your Barack Obama. <laughs> Gonna bounce your Barack Obama. Put him in your hand, Barack Obama. We have no good attacks. Bounce that Obama. That's what we did. Thanks, Obama. Oh, God. They just keep... Reeves saw that guy, buddy? I don't even have any adventures left. I'm adventureless. These cards are just not gonna compete with my... You really need to kill the Great Hen, or else he's just dead. Yeah, unfortunately, that's not a super easy thing to do. Yeah, artifacts are kind of hard to kill. Yardifacts! I'm Pirate Michael. Yardifacts! Hashtag Pirate Michael. <laughs> Hashtag Pirate pur Mutual. Pirate. I'm a purr to the curb burn. You're my girl to purr to the curb burn. This lets me draw two cards, just to be clear. And gain two life. Oh god, and she gets a counter. Oh damn, look at that burn. Artifact wasn't hard to kill, it kinda killed itself. Oh God damn. That's a pretty good burn actually. Yeah, we'll let down. I get to draw another one? Oh boy. Sometimes you can make a game too complicated. Nice. Remember when, when Mike B said great hand draws an Obama? Obama? <laughs> What? <laughs> this isn't. I don't know what's going on anymore. I still think I'm right. It's not a bomb. It makes bombs. 
But isn't a card that makes bombs still very good? Sure. Isn't that almost better than a bomb? Maybe. Would you rather have one single bomb or a bomb factory that manufactures bombs? Touche. Okay. It's pronounced touch. So it's better than a bomb. So I was still right. It's not a bomb. Done. Okay. That's fair. Give me that out muscle. Oh, God. All these cards are just getting big and drawing us more cards. Like, this never shrinks because it's just, like, it just keeps replacing itself. Okay. Well, this should be the end of the... This should be the end of the battle, I guess. Mike's mom is a bomb factory. Wow. It's true. Man, and you got a midnight clock? Jeez. Midnight clock keeps on ticking, ticking. So 6 plus 11, 12, 13, 14. If they block here, they take a, a lot. They basically almost die, so. They're not one of this game, man. They go to one if they want to block that curious pair. Wow. It's aggressive. Bold strategy. Okay. Michael B. lives in the tree. And we get to draw seven at some point if we really want to. We have six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven mana, so we can add like three counters a turn. Okay, we won the match. We would have drawn that for the turn, which is unexciting. I wonder how we would have won that game. If Midnight Clap didn't clap, <laughs> didn't tap for mana, would it be worth playing? Um, I don't know. It's what your mom gave me, the Midnight Clap. <laughs> I don't think it would be nearly as good or as expensive if it didn't tap for mana. Like, it costs nine mana. It'd probably be like... <laughs> oh, God. It would probably be like seven mana. I don't know. I think the mana's really good. Nifty Chris, tell she Chris I said hi. What are you with your hand? I'm feeling the air. Oh, all right. I'm absorbing its flavor. I thought you were showing me your sausage fingers. <laughs> she Chris, hi. I miss you guys. You just told her yourself. <gasps> oh. I want to meet that dog. I want to... <laughs> Michael, that's a fake dog. That ain't a fake dog. Oh, no, I'm not talking about that dog. I was dog. like, Michael, that's a fake... I'm talking about Chris's dog. <laughs> oh, Nigel? Yeah. Yeah, Nigel's a cutie, dude. Next year we can go. Dude, how does someone have 70 trophies? I literally said that earlier today. I was Someone like, has 70 trophies? how have you drafted? I haven't even done fucking 20 drafts, let alone let alone 170. I guess if you're just like a fiend who lives in the basement, you just fire him off over and over again, right? Serious follow-up question. Can Sausage Fingers cause Midnight Clap? <laughs> <laughs> you know, maybe. It's hard to say, you know. It depends on it depends on if you how well you clean your sausage fingers. This is both of you are brats for living so far away. We live about the farthest you can get, actually. It's, it's pretty close. Yeah, he's right. I'll keep this hand. But we got planes. Maybe you do. Yeah, I own several. Wow, really? Yeah. And you still can't even afford meals sometimes? Uh do you know the up cost on all those planes? The up cost? I mean the maintenance. I guess I don't. That's true. If we move to Alaska, we can make it far. That's true. You go to Alaska, I'll go to Cuba. <laughs> and then <laughs> And then we'll just be as far as possible. Well, keep it in the U.S. Just just live in Miami. Okay. What about Puerto Rico? Okay. Puerto Rico! Remember that song? No. It wasn't a song. It was just that slow. It was just like that. You know what? Shut up. My name is Cuban. Then you can do Cuban cube drafts. Wow. Oh, look at this tempting witch. That's real tempting. What does that card even do? What doesn't it do? Huh? Apparently nothing. You didn't even think about that one, did you, smart guy? Thank you. Oh, Phil, thank you so much for the reason, buddy. Welcome back. I'm just going to play this guy. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> of course. Of course. What? That was weird. Game. If Midnight Clap didn't clap, didn't tap for mana, would it be worth playing? Um, I don't know. It's, it's 
That's what your mom gave me, the Midnight Clap. <laughs> okay. If Midnight Clap didn't... Yeah, that's pretty good. You 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 equated that more with Jack Black than the Scat Man? Skip it, 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 it. Play this queen. Did IP did I close get IP ban? I don't think so. I don't think so. Michael B. I like that the blue black deck has basically no answers for a midnight clock, so I'm just gonna like draw seven eventually. Jack Black was an easier reference for people. To, I think you underestimate the power my, of Scatman. My people. Skip it, dip, 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 dip. Come at me, witch. What's your favorite kind of sandwich, Michael? A Reuben. Yeah, that's what I said. Oh. Name me a sandwich better. I'll wait. Turkey Reuben. Got That's it. the same sandwich. Oh, wow. It's the same thing. The slightly different meat. We're gonna need corporate's gonna need you to find the difference between these two pictures of a turkey Reuben and a regular Reuben. They're the same picture. The same. <laughs> also, if you want to be civic, specific, you want to be civic. You want to say turkey pastrami Reuben, because that's better. Yeah, but if you're having a turkey Reuben, usually it's implied that it's pastrami. Yeah. Okay. Because you're making the sandwich with the same components that you would with a regular Reuben with pastrami. I, I like I like coleslaw or sauerkraut. Phil, I did get the I did get the codes you sent. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna I'm gonna give them out once we do some arena stuff. Um, yeah, with coleslaw, I believe it's called a Rachel or something like that. No, that's from Friends. <laughs> What's with you and the Friends references tonight? I'm sorry, man. I just I thought you wanted to know. <gasps> oh boy, hold up, hold up. Might be. What's your opinion on the Monte Cristo sandwich? Uh, it's pretty good. Jelly and meat is kind of a weird combo, but it works. Jelly and meat. Gel, jelly it's, and meat. It's, it's more like a dessert than a sandwich, but jelly, it's good. Jelly, meat, meat, jelly and meat. Jelly and meat? Honey mustard plus spicy brown mustard? Whoa, that's crazy. Is it? Doesn't that just break regular mustard because they cancel each other out? You don't know anything about mustard, do you? God. What a giant opportunity. I mean, I assume they're going to bounce this guy, but, you know, maybe not. Draw a bunch of cards. Wow. Wait. Oh, that's sad. I mean, actually, getting rid of a Drown on the Lock is pretty fine. Oh, yes. Draw seven cards. Wow, this is just mono gas. You drew no lands. That's pretty good. That's pretty insane, yeah. How'd you do it? Um, you know what? Sure. You can have my best card. Guess they take the paladin. Or this, maybe. Skip it up, dip it up, dip dip dip. Dup de dup de I'm the scat man. Are you? I don't know, man. It's hard to say. Who knows how scatting scatting men work? Sing Numa Numa, please. No, thank you. Is that the right one? That's yeah, that's the right one. I like how you can tell how good your hand is by how long it takes your opponent to choose a card. They should choose the scoop. Got him. Oh, you... God, you did it. Okay, now I discard two. Scooped him. Sure. Scarecrow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we can go two. Witching will draw. Mm. Phase. I mean, they just did a bunch of good stuff, so. I guess. I guess. Great hinge. Oh, all right. That's a dude. It's a little bear man. 
Uh, I don't need any more lands. I don't even know if I want this guy. Just a 2-2 two, two for 2. Nothing special. Sir Farron. The Great. Hen, the Henge Hammer. That's the one that tramples, bros? It gives plus X, plus X for X as its power. Yeah. Oh, God. I'm going to drown in the lock again. No? Okay. I can mill me. That's cool, man. Ooh, those, that was a good hit. Mm, that one's fine. Really? You played that over this... Um... Sure. I mean, you knew that was there. So that was a weird decision. Two, three, four. Um, I'll use this so we can keep up out muscle. Seems pretty good. Yeah, never don't have it. I mean, they did a great job of dispatching our entire hand, so. Steel Gaze Griffin. Steel Gaze Peter Griffin. Is your old YouTube videos you had Neil Kaming in space? Uh, no, Kenji uh, Newmont Gaming was owned by Kenji and they paid me to write articles and make content for them. Sure. Huh, it's pretty good. It's uh, pretty good. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we should have waited to play this guy, I guess. But, I mean, we didn't know we were drawing a great hinge. But I guess there's no real benefit to having him on board either, so... Sure. <laughs> you got it. <sighs> I'd like to play some Pioneer, but it doesn't seem easy to find deck lists. You're, you got it. Yeah, I'll use that. I'll, I'll lose that mana. Give me a adventure card. <laughs> they did it. They literally listened to me. You're as cold as ice. You draw into cot. Oof. 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 All right, well, let's do it, I guess. I don't think you have it. Though if you do, it's really this is really bad for us. Okay, you didn't. Seems good. So next time we can play that guy. Baked into a pie. Give me that food. I mean, I would probably would have killed this in, in response because then we don't get the the Garenbrig Carver, which is going to draw us two cards next turn. Thank you. Clouded days. Thanks so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. 
Hmm. 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 I consider that a good draw. Well, I feel like we should always just use the henge. All right, draw two. There's one. Here's two. <laughs> okay, so we can play that. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Three, four, five, six. I was going to say, I mean, goodness, this card card's irrelevant right now, but. Hmm. Thank you. I kind of just want to play this instead of getting in there for two. Yeah, playing that seems better. Raymond Whiteman, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Um, I guess we're just passing here. We have five cards in our library. Oh, boy. We should probably figure out how to win the game. <laughs> Yikes. Oh, wow, we have three in library. Well, two lands are gone, I guess. Where's our midnight clock? It's a, it's exiled. Wow, we oh. just decked ourselves. That's hilarious. Well, we had a good run, at least. We can kill him this turn. <laughs> I mean, we're actually not tremendously far. There's no way they can ever kill us on the crackback, so. Sure. 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 So you take three, and we're just going to sack this. Play this, we go to one card, we have to win next turn. They have two blockers. We take one, two, three. Thank you. I don't think we can do it. This is a five five though, so they go. So they actually take one, two, three plus five. So they actually take eight. Just close. That's hilarious. Yeah, we gave it a shot. Well, we're not dead yet. Yeah, but we are. Mm, I don't think so. Kerr with the resub. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate you. Really appreciate you. And if they have no more creatures? No, they have a thing. Oh, that's Thank not a creature. You. Whenever a creature control dies, put it on the bottom of the center. Sorry, I paid that for turn a creature from your graveyard to the battlefield like this. But yeah, okay, so you can pay three and put a creature from your graveyard on the battlefield. You can pay two. Pay two. Smart. They they figured it out. Sure. They had the combo. Yeah, mythic rare into. Put your dude thank on the battlefield. You. Cabal and thank you so much for the re for the sub. Really appreciate it, Mr. Tasty. Thank you so much for the resub. You guys are awesome. <sighs> Interesting. Got any more midnight clocks? I don't. Y'all got any more than midnight clocks? I just said I don't. I just wanted to say it that way. Why? Because I like that voice. What about it do you like? It's funny. It's what? funny. Is it? I think so. What's funny about it? It just is, man. I can't is. explain it. It is what? I hate you. What's, what's hate? That's what I am. Tell me about this hatred you feel. Does it? It runs deep. Does it well up within you? Yes. Can you harness it? Sometimes. Look at deck. Our card engine was too powerful. Wow! Just kick my chair, why don't you? It wasn't a kick. It was a light tap. I want to. I'm keeping both of these, my dudes. 
I'm keeping both of these, my dudes. It is Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> Why is that meme so good? I don't know, because it's that... Fr- what is it, a frog? I don't remember. It's a frog, Michael. Don't be ridiculous. I think it is a frog. I think it is a Wednesday, my dude. There's another one. Oh, my God. Only Tuesdays 27... What is this? Who is this? Are they just missing land drops? Oh, God, they suck. Oh, you can do the Shahili combo. Shahili? Yeah. Shahili, Shahili. <laughs> Sahili. Fine, God. Fine, I'll say it correctly. Wow, I'm so sorry for inconveniencing you. Yeah, well. <laughs> it is Wednesday, my dudes. <laughs> That's a chonk frog if I've ever seen one. Have you ever seen one? Actually, all ch- all frogs are chonk. If you believe. They're naturally chonk. Like I hippos. Think you're naturally chonk. No, not naturally. Un- unnaturally chonk? What would you look like if you were skinny? You could see. Uh, when I, I was skinny when I was younger. Yeah, but you looked completely different then. It's not like you were like, you wouldn't look like you look now, only skinny. Oh, sure, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had blonde hair back then, too. Is this I good? Fat in my, Drawing my a hair. card off Great Henge and having Great Henge resolve? I think getting fat makes your hair darker. Darker? Yeah. I think you just literally made this shit up. I did, yeah. It is Wednesday, I did dudes. use to have blonde hair, though. Then I spent too many years in the basement. Oh, Shahili, you're breaking my heart. You're shaking my confidence daily. You know that jam? No. Really? Nope. Nip. 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 Oh, look at that. We can run away together every day, Michael. Run away. Gonna get a food. Mike B, I remember when I first started watching the stream, you were doing keto. Did that derail or was it causing you issues? Keto is tough. You have to like cook all your own food, basically. Yeah, Mike literally doesn't cook any food. <laughs> He's I like, mean, if I can't get it at the McDonald's drive thru, I don't want it. <laughs> wow. Hey, sometimes I buy frozen pizzas. Occasionally I make spaghetti. Yeah, I don't think so. I make, a, I make a mean PB and J. Yeah, you make them with tortillas. <laughs> That was one time, okay? Yeah. Desperate times. Why are they still playing this game? They saw our whole deck. Let me tell you something, man. No, I never got like the keto sickness some people get. I oh, obviously though, with the 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 Patreon patronage. Thank you so much, dude. Really appreciate you. Also, if you guys don't know, you can go to patreon.com slash franklapore. And if you don't want to subscribe on Twitch, if you watch the YouTube videos and you want to support the content, you can definitely uh, get away with paying one or two dollars a month on Patreon to support the channel. So, do we have nine power on board plus an appetite? Are those dead? Like, why are we? It is Wednesday, my dude. Mike paid me three dollars to see my deck. What does that even mean? Did I? I bet you did. I don't remember that. I missed the end of the afternoon stream after there was 13 shots fired and about 30 cops out of... Whoa. Huh? That's crazy. That is crazy. What a time to be alive. Did you catch any bullets? Did you? Did you catch them? Like Pokemon? Gotta Gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all. In America, that'd be a great place to catch bullets. On Pokemon? No, in America. You know what? I used to live in America. You still do. Shit. <laughs> he got me. Did I? I don't know, man. Why are you like this? I did not. I hid in my apartment until the cops showed up. That's a pretty solid strategy. Bullets are pretty dangerous. Don't know if Florida still counts as America? Wow. I think Florida is the epitome of america epitome that's not the right word (laughs) epitome that's what epitome (laughs) because how crazy we are i was i was actually up really late last night because i couldn't stop reading my epitome (laughs) god i love this turtle so much such a turtle 
Give me a witching well. Opening witching well. Or opening. Give me that stupid innkeeper. I missed the end because I had to come here to work. Thankfully, we're super dead now, so I can watch the stream. Nice. Mike, say that word. Canopy? Tireless Tractor. Thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate you and all your on all your life do you prefer kenopi yeah like from the jedi from the from the masters of the jedi series obi-wan kenopi you know what i'm saying dude did someone think i was going to pronounce it kenopi was that the was that the the joke you're real good thank you look at that guy tap this guy doesn't do anything Oh, Cecilia, that's my cool B. Cast Queen of Ice from the Exile Zone. Whatever. 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 I would say Obi-Wan Kenobi is the epitome of Star Wars. <laughs> if you guys know what I mean. Get him. Are my chats not going through? I once I can stop a speeding bullet once. It hurts a lot. <laughs> oh no, we got him. We got him. Oh wow, I just found a picture of Mike Skinny on the internet. <laughs> oh, what a great Photoshop. <laughs> this is courtesy of uh, Nifty Chris. Wow, he looks. <laughs> it's really blended so well. That's amazing. I'm really surprised. I didn't think he'd look like that. It's like your head stayed big, but your whole other body is small. That's not a Photoshop. Yeah, that's MS Paint. Fair. 100,000 hours in MS Paint. <laughs> <laughs> that's, yeah, that's good. You should sell Mike masks for Halloween. Wow. Even his mouth stayed small. Wow. Got him. God, they just guys. kill my dude? God, they never don't have a way to kill my dude. Do 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 do. Super Fritz, yeah. I love Brian Regan. His stuff's great. Cause he's a Super Fritz. Super Fritz. He's Super Fritz. -y. You like that song from uh, Rick James? Yes, yeah, alright. It's really good, man. <sighs> what do I to do what do i have to do where are my glasses man where are your glasses yeah you don't wear glasses dude you really need to <sighs> oh well the masks come with the goofy glasses you're always putting on uh you know what sure I had a beverage. Foreboding fruitums. You got it. Going down. If you win, you get beverage. If you lose, you do not. Wow. It's brutal. It's really brutal, man. Yeah, better not lose then. Don't tell me what to do. I'll lose whenever I want. Yeah, gain that life. Frank was hinting that you go get him some water. <laughs> was I doing that? Oh, look at Steely Griffin. Steely Griff. I would love a green source. Magic. How are you going to act? Thank you. So I think we just... I'm tempted to like insatiable appetite and then out muscle it's such a if they have like a bounce spell though it's such a blowout I guess we can actually just attack right going down to the witching
No, I'm good. That was good. Insatiable Appetite was a removal spell. Michael Beeswax. You should EOT bake into a pie so you can giant opportunity. What does that even mean? Not bake into a pie. Oh, then. God, so many steel gaze griffins. See you, gaze griffin. That's not a card we want. Tag with all these dudes. All right. G -g -g get them. Get them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Huh. I wonder if we actually sack this guy. Make a food out muscle this thing. They've already used their bake. The problem is if they have like epic downfall, it's pretty good. I think we can wait. No. That's a good one. Not really when they don't have any artifacts. It's just kind of boring. Oh yeah. Forgot about that part. Great hinge. Alright, we're just gonna have to go for it here. Fuck. Could they ever not have it? The answer is no. They always have it. Oh well, I guess it's good old one for one. Right? Two for one? Two for one, I guess. I have so much food right now. Where so I get you're the, a porker. Where did I get the third food, actually? If I already had two food, I probably would have just played this last turn and then sack instead of like I didn't even realize I had three foods. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's I'm... because it was a it was because it was a four power, so it made two foods. Never mind. Two foods, two two foods. You okay? Two 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 foods. <sighs> Must be nice. I would consider that a pretty good draw. Yep. <laughs> one, one. You got it, my dude. Oh, and you can play on the same turn. Congratulations. So good at this game. So good. So good at the game. I'm not getting a ghosting impression. I'm just getting a... They save their removal until they can get a really good value out of it. Yeah, their deck is just very good. I mean, I think we got... Yeah, so four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean... But then we have to sack two foods to survive, so... And what does this even do for us? Nothing. Chris, have a good night, buddy. Enjoy your show. Uh, so we could have played that draw two put them both on the bottom, draw two more, and wouldn't have mana for that. Yep. Alright, so currently 3-2 in games.
Hey, I was very distracted before, and can this... And laptop was dying, wanted to say GG. Your deck is friggin' sick. Didn't even realize I was playing until after the game was over. I love the stream, big fan. Good luck with the next one. Playing Pioneer and Freeform on MGO can confirm four colors so you can eat a D. Teferi plus Kami Cat plus either. Oh god, that sounds absolutely miserable. Oh god. I wonder if the format's just not going to be fun until the banned and restricted list. Oh, this wasn't. No, this wasn't. This was round one opponent, not round two opponent. Where did the... I found it. Are you okay? Are you moving in slow motion? Are you having a stroke? Why would I... How is that having a stroke, man? So you are? No. He is. <sighs> <sighs> yeah, show your teeth. You mean like that Lady Gaga song? Is there a song called Show Your Teeth by Lady Gaga? You tell me, chat. <laughs> Stroke no joke, that's true. We were on the way to say goodbye to our dog, but on our way there, she produced the smallest amount of urine, so the vet says we should... Oh, God. Jeez. Wow, Monsanto got worse than than it was earlier, buddy. Lance, your wife got you a sweet jacket for Michael's birthday? That's sick, dude. <laughs> it is Wednesday, my dudes. God, Monsanto, dude. As someone who literally also took his cat to the vet today, <laughs> I know the feeling. I mean, I don't, because it wasn't nearly as heartbreaking, but I guess I, I mean, I know the concerned pet owner feeling. What are the odds they have didn't say please? Probably like 70, I think. 70 odds. So you have 30% chance of this resolving, is what you're saying? Hey, pretty good. They're going to draw two or they're going to peel away. They're going to draw them two. It was legitimately my birthday today. You're the one people, the only people I feel like telling without it feeling awkward. Wow, you and Mike have the same birthday? That's really weird, dude. Are you okay? No. I feel like he's, I feel like he's going to throw up on his birthday. It's, it kind of sucks. What a shitty birthday, dude. Your shitty birthday. I'm, I'm, wow. You know, you don't have to be rude, okay? Maybe I do. Do you? It makes me feel better. Wow, does it? Being rude? Yeah. Makes you feel better. Mm-hmm. DSP would be weird in a blue-red deck. What's DSP? Death Shrite Pommen? Yeah, that's it. The new guy's in the corner puking his guts out. Oh my god. All because you want to save a few bucks on some brake pads. Get out! Now! Remember that? It's from Tommy Boy. Oh, yeah. Wow, they're really just killing all my things. It's really just one for one all day. 
Peel from reality. Oops, there goes gravity. I think your brain has a thick candy shell. <laughs> I, I think it's going to be okay, Richard. They have a thick candy shell. Oh, shit. <laughs> Sorry, were you talking? <laughs> Did I catch a niner in there? Were you dialing from a walkie-talkie? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus, crying out loud. What are you doing here? Oh, wow, you're drawing so many cards. I had to show I had to show Mike Tommyboy for the first time the other day. He hadn't seen it. Oh, bees, save yourselves. <laughs> I can't believe that worked. Oh, I think I just threw up on this anthill. Go save yourself! Oh, hey, prehistoric forest. Not so much here or here, but right here. I'm just gonna run away together. Oh, actually, no, I'm an insatiable. I forgot this would actually save this guy, so that's actually better. I don't want the. I don't want to bounce a tome raider here if I don't have to. A tomb raider? What? What? The, it's an epitome raider. Oh. I'm just going to play this. Let's keep up the blue in case we draw green. I don't know just draw a card here. And we did it. Tommy want wingy. Fat guy in a little coat. <laughs> Fat guy in a little coat. Richard! <laughs> now I understand all the times you said Richard like that. Oh my god. <laughs> I've never understood that until now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you do that like, all the time. Richard! I thought that was just a weird thing you said. Why is he saying it like that? <laughs> That guy and a Michael B. I want to actually run away together. This guy and this guy. I think Tommy Boy is better, but like it's basically just the same movie, right? I've never seen Black Sheep either. They both have a low score on Rotten Tomatoes. Oh yeah, they do. I mean, they're not cinema. It's not solid. They're not solid. Uh, they're not like classic films that you're going to be like, ooh, what do you like better, Citizen Kane or Tommy Boy? My money's on Tommy Boy. Out of those two, you mean? Yeah. Okay. Okay, man. Don't get me wrong. Sitting's Gain is a good movie. Sitting's Gain? <laughs> Sitting's Gain is a good movie. <laughs> That's but, old Sitting's Gain. I don't know. It's a little, uh, I, I want to say it's overhyped, but that's probably not fair because I only watched it, I didn't watch it super recently, but everyone said about how good it was. So about as how good it was. And then you watch it. And then you're like, what? And you're like, this is pretty good, but I you know. Get it. It's whatever. What? You know I have this. Man, if this is Arena, they'd never forget. Oh, they were like, I forgot. Dang it. Okay. I believe you. Fat guy in a little coat. Oh, all right. I like that twit that just said Marvel movies aren't cinema. I think you mean tweet. I mean, no matter what he says, I'm not going to call Martin Scorsese a twit. That just ain't happening. I think that dude. was just a mis misspelling, maybe? No, that's a thwack. Thwack would call him a twit. Hmm, okay. Richard! <laughs> Hold me! Wow, you just got rid of my Great Henge and my Midnight Clock in the same stroke? That's pretty good. That's so stupid. I'm so mad. Uh, Who's the... What's his name? Who's the what's his name? 
Who's the what's his name? The guy who directed E.T. Steven Spielberg. Didn't he recently say that, like, Guardians of the Galaxy was awesome? Steven Spielberg. <laughs> what? Huh? Oh. Michael? This is a real fat guy in a low coat situation. And to be fair, just because he made good things doesn't mean you have the best opinions. Uh, is this combat damage? Yeah, let's get rid of that idiot. One, two, three. Also, taste is taste. What are you going to do? Some people just don't like superhero stuff. Like your mom? No, she likes them. My mom loves superhero stuff. You take that back. <laughs> She's basically a superhero. Okay. Did you hear me? Are Who are you, you talking to, man? Are you ready Certainly not me. What? Certainly. Certainly. <laughs> That's from the Three Stooges. I like how I do a reference and you do a reference from the same thing and you're like, that's from that thing. <laughs> oh, really? Man. Well, sometimes I don't Thank think God you know, you're man. here, man. I would have no idea. Richard! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this is five in the air. Let's hope we don't die, I guess. They have one card in hand. Alright, we should be fine. Nancy Barbablibu is a saint. She must know her name is Brenda. Brenda Barbablibu? Well, it used to be. It's not Barbablibu anymore? No. She, she married. She married who? Mr. Barbablibu? No. Is that your That's new dad? She divorced. Dang. Mr. Barbablibu. Most movies are formulaic, though. I don't think formulaic necessarily means a bad thing. It doesn't mean a bad thing. Oh, a giant opportunity has presented itself. What's that link? Stop it. Don't be like this. Richard, I'm so happy. Yikes. Frank, any chance this will be the year you drop your Mike B Christmas album covers? Your favorite 12 songs sang with Mike B as the lyrics? <laughs> uh, yeah, it's definitely possible. We could do that. We could do it. Sweet Michael B's. Ba -ba -da. Michael B's every day. You got it. One, two, three, one, two, one, two. So we can gain a six life next turn, which keeps us alive. But to say a genre is from like as much of an argument for or against anything. I, yeah, I agree with that. I think 95% of the movies you're going to watch are formulaic. So I really don't think that's actually like a, any kind of. And most movies have a formula. That's how they structure them. That's how you structure your face. That doesn't make any sense, Frank. You're stupid. I hate you. <sighs> Barge Magarge If I don't have a Bobby Butters Buttery Biscuit shirt by Christmas I'm going to be very disappointed Wow Is that true? Scrobers roasting on an open fire Mike be nipping at your nose <laughs> Yuletide Mike B's Singing things my choir. Merry Mike B's. <laughs> Jesus Christ. To you. Oh, we're just going to take it here. Wow. They didn't. Hmm. I'm pretty sure they could have killed. No, they couldn't. We went up to one. Ch 
chestnuts roasting on a Michael B. Michael B. has a big nose. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. So we can gain nine life. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we actually have to make giant opportunity to make some. So four for this guy, one, five, six. So we actually, if we go to eight, we take one, two, three, four, five, six, and then they can loot to make this seven, eight. So we just have to keep up the. Okay, that's fine, I guess. It doesn't have haste. Okay, so the card you searched for is the one you discarded. All right. Good to know. Interesting. A bold strategy, Smotten. Four. What? Huh. All right. Why? I don't know what's going on here. Jack Frost biting off your toes. I'm gonna play this guy first. So we can draw a card and see what we hit. That's good. Perfect. Yuletide Michaels being sung by a choir. Any Jund ideas in Pioneer? Not even one. I haven't brewed anything or thought of any any ideas for Pioneer. Okay. Do they have a second barge in? Is that the trick here? Well, it wouldn't kill this. It would just kill this. So that'd be interesting. And it's also attacking creatures, so no. Peel away? Yeah, okay. Oh, they're bouncing both of these and not... This is all very interesting. Peel away, peel away, peel away. Oh, oh, ee, ee, ee. Remember that song? No. Yes, you do. You ain't got a lot, Craig. Okay. Frank Harston posted an article with some brews. Just pretend you're him and say you're streaming the brews from your article. I mean, yeah. Four, five, six. Oh, are, are you okay? Oh, God. Are, are you all right? That smells really bad. Dude. No, I don't think so, man. Oh, it probably God. smells fine. Oh, Jesus. Are you okay? It's like rotten cabbage. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's too bad. I'm going to crack this now because if they happen to have like three damage to our face, then we die in response to us cracking it. So I feel like we could really use a can really use a breakthrough here that's yep that's not it it's one two three four five six that'd be a good draw i don't credit with behemoth we're just gonna alpha and hope that gets the job done that's that's what we're doing here All right. And they never don't have it.
Oh, we still win? Because they blocked terribly? What the fu- What? That must, that must have been a misclick or something. Uh, okay. You know what? I'll take it. Daddy will take it. I, I didn't even look at the blocks. I was just like, well, I know we're getting four exactly if you block correctly. And I just assumed you blocked correctly and then killed one of my guys. So we didn't get four exactly, but we still got Dang. five exactly? Because you blocked poorly? I don't even know, man. Jarman, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. I just watched the video with the salt conversation. I have to say you're a madman for using salted uh, butter for cooking. Wow. Jeez. Totally. I'm heading out. You might be able a good one. I hope you're regular. I wanted to say that I've been a long-time YouTube viewer since the beginning and was heavily critical of you and your reaction to certain things like top takes and whatnot. But I just want to say that I know you're generally a good dude and I hope you to watch for many days. Come on. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you, dude. That means a lot to hear. And yeah, I get salty sometimes, but like, I don't like it, and I don't mean to. You get real salty. Shh. <laughs> they didn't block the four. Oh wow, they didn't block the. That's that is weird. That's probably why you don't play poker with me. You can't handle any more salt. It's just not my blood pressure, man. If we draw a forest, I'll play this Sir Farron, or I'll play forest. Uh, now I just want the witch in well. Which? In well. Hmm. Which in Manuel? Bottom you and top you. That's a nice two drop. I said, girl, that's a nice two drop. What? That's inappropriate, Michael. Why? I mean, they're just going to kill this, right? Yeah, what are you going to do? I mean, put it in the graveyard, I guess. It is Wednesday, my dudes. Nope, still not. Dang it, he's right. Hey, man, show me your two drops. Now that sounds inappropriate. Just show them to me. Do it. <laughs> show me your little gumdrops, Michael. Gumdrops? Wow. 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 Grab them by the two drops, wow. <laughs> nope, don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, just gonna pass here and draw some crads. No, don't like that. <laughs> Bet you didn't even know we had that, did you? No, I knew. No, you didn't know. Yeah, it's been there a couple times. A couple times. Yeah. Oh, scoots. I view the stream. Do you? Yeah. Do you? I mean, not that often, but I do. Wow, that's messed up, dude. Well, because I, I tend to uh, join uh, them more uh, than uh, I watch uh, them. Uh, so it is there? No. You would. Not see it. Think about it. Oh god, this is gonna be a bloodbath. Are you ready for the bloodbath? Yes. Block there, take eight. Sure. Go Did we ever get the commands back? No. Yeah. I mean, like, the problem is, like, MTG Bot is a free service provided by Dan Bopes. And, like, as someone who has n unfortunately uh, and regrettably not supported Dan uh, for MTG Bot, I have no right to complain whatsoever if something goes wrong. Oh, wow. Six, huh? So this costs three. Yes. Seems good. And taps are two, so basically it costs one. It basically costs one. I think we just win this game. If you guys haven't done so, check out patreon.com slash Frank Lepore. I would love... You would love... If you guys could support the channel with a dollar or two dollars a month over there. Okay. Go to the block phase. So we're just going to try to get rid of this dude, but I don't think it's going to work. So we're going to... Going down to the wishing well. 
If they have removal, that's really sad, but what are you going to do? Oh, you're bouncing that guy. So you just take eight here? Holy smokes. And then I just get to replay this guy as a 3-3 three, three with a counter, with a with two, oh jeez, I gained two life, draw a card. Oh, okay. <laughs> come on, Steel Gaze Griffin. Come at me, bro. Let me see that haggler. Oh, they could not because they didn't have the mana. That's true. So it's unfortunate for them. Get wrecked, Rivana. I don't see how they uh I don't see how they win here. I'm no expert, but I'm kind of an expert. But if you're not an expert, I don't know what is. What do they got? One, two, three, four, five, so they can actually only kill one of these dudes. Hey, that's an eight seven, good buddy. Okay, you got it. Put this guy in the front. Yeah. Are you okay? Huh? What? Are you okay? Yes. Are you sure? No. Okay. Do we play land this turn? Not yet. Okay. Oh, Rob Coil Engine, what's going on, my dude? Okay. <laughs> Talk about engines. Ha 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 ha. Let's return to the game. I want to see who would have drawn off this thing. Midnight Clock. Okay. Yeah, our deck was pretty good. I thought this deck was sweet. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on patreon.com slash franklapart. Coolstuffinc.com every Wednesday. Today I had a new article go up. If you're watching on YouTube, it's going to be Wednesday. Today I had a new article go up. On YouTube, it is Wednesday, my dudes. And I had a new article go up about my thoughts on the bannings and standard. And uh, definitely check that out to coolstuffinc.com. And I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.